Welcome sa ating new math lesson. Ako nga pala si Sir Wapi. At ito ang ating topic ngayon. Cash value or cash price. The cash value or cash price is equal to the down payment, if there's any, plus the present value of the installment payments. So ang cash value daw ay equal sa down payment kung sakaling meron lang, kung sakaling may down payment. Plus, ipa-plus natin yung total present value ng lahat ng regular payments or installment payments. Yun yung R. Kung wala namang down payment, kukunin lang natin yung total present value ng lahat ng installment payments. So again, ito ang down payment plus the present value is equal to the cash value. Okay, bigyan tayo ng example ngayon. Mr. Ribaya paid 200,000 pesos as down payment for a car. The remaining amount is to be settled by paying 16,200 pesos at the end of each month for 5 years. If interest is 10.5% compounded monthly, what is the cash price of his car? So from the problem, get down natin lahat ng given. So, from the problem, tingnan natin kung magkano yung total na magagasas ni Mr. Ibaya sa pagbili niya ng kanyang kotse. Ilang beses bang magbabayad ng 16,200 pesos si Mr. Ibaya? So, sabi dun kanina, monthly, so 12 times a year ang pagbabayad niya. Aabutin niyo yun ng limang taon. So, para malaman natin yung total, sabihin, 5 times 12 So, equal 60. So, 60 times siyang magbabayad ng 16,200 pesos. Imumultiply ngayon natin yan. 16,200 times 60. So, makakaubo siya ng 972,000. So, ang total ay 972,000 pesos. Ipa-plus natin yung down payment niya na 200,000 pesos. So, ang kabuuan na magagasas niya ay 1,172,000 pesos. Yan yung mauubos na pera ni Mr. Ribaya. Umpitin naman natin yung mode of payment na pinili niya. So, jot down natin yung given. Down payment, 200,000 pesos. Regular payment, 16,200 pesos. Time, 5 years. Rate of interest, 10.5% or 0.105. Frequency of conversion, since it is monthly, 12. So, find CV or cash value. Ito ang formula ulit para makuha ang present value ng simple annuity. So, substitute natin yung mga given kanina. So, the calculated value is 753,702 pesos and 20 centavos. 
Ito ngayon yung present value ng ating annuity. Now, kunin natin yung cash value. Sabi doon, kailangan natin, kailangan natin yung down payment since naghulog naman siya ng 200,000 pesos. So, the cash value is equal to the down payment plus the present value. Cash value equals 200,000 pesos yung down payment niya sa sasakyan plus yung present value yung nakumpit natin sa taas that is 753,702 pesos and 20 centavos. So, equals ang cash value natin ngayon ay 953,702 pesos and 20 centavos. Ito yung cash value or cash price ng sasakyan ni Mr. Ribaya. Kunin natin yung difference. Kanina, installment basis, ito yung nakumpit natin, 1,172,000. Kung ikakash ni Mr. Ribaya, ito lang yung magagastos ni Mr. Ribaya, 953,702 pesos and 20 centavos. So, subtract nga natin, magkano bang matitipid niya kung sakaling ikakash niya? So, ito, 218,297 pesos and 80 centavos. Ganito yung matitipid ni Mr. Ribaya kung sakaling ikakash niya. Next example, Paolo borrowed 100,000 pesos. He agrees to pay the principal plus interest by paying an equal amount of money each year for 3 years. What should be his annual payment if interest is 8% compounded annually? Ano ba yung 100,000 pesos na ito sa problem? Okay, tama. Ito yung principal. Ano kaya yung inahanap dito sa may problem na to? Okay, correct. Ang inahanap dito ay ang regular payment o yung capital letter R. Okay, mula sa problem, jot down natin yung given. P equals 100,000 pesos. T or time equals 3 years. The rate of interest, 8% or 0.08. The frequency of conversion or M, that is 1 each year. Sabi nga nun, ano? So, annually. Find the regular payments. Ito yung formula ang gagamitin natin para sa regular payments. Remind ko lang uli, pag ginamit nyo ang inyong scientific calculator, itong bracket na to ay parenthesis lang din sa inyong calculator. Okay, substitute natin yung mga given. Okay, the computed value is 38,803 pesos and 35 centavos. Okay, kayo naman. Pwede nyo itry itong sagutan. Ang dapat nyo maging sagot ay Number 2 The answer is, thanks for watching, sana ay may natutunan kayo sa ating bagong video lesson about finding the cash value of simple annuity and finding the regular payment of a simple annuity. Click the subscribe button and the notification bell for more updates of our videos.
Not so easy.